हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन द आईआईटी जैम 2022 मैथमेटिकल सॉल्यूशंस भी सो टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द क्वेश्चन नंबर 31 व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू द सीक्वेंस एंड द सीरीज आंसर हाउ यू कैन सी दैट सिंस इट कैरीज ऑफ द टू मार्क्स एनी ऑफ द क्वेश्चन बिलोंग टू दिस कैटेगरीज ऑफ द टू मार्क्स एंड मोर देन वन करेक्ट ऑप्शंस आर देयर सो लेट्स सी हाउ यू कैन सॉल्व दिस वन सो द फर्स्ट पार्ट इज माय माइनस 1 दैट इज अल्टरनेटिंग सीरीज इज देयर सो व्हेनेवर देयर इज अल्टरनेटिंग सीरीज यू हैव टू चेक द टू कंडीशंस Firstly, a n is a decreasing sequence. Second is a n goes to the zero as n approaches infinity. Now we can check for this series. Is this the decreasing sequence? You can easily see that the first value is my one by three. Then n is two. Then it's a one by nine. Then it's a one by twenty-seven. You can see it's a decreasing sequence. What is the limit as n approaches infinity? You can see easily this is my here goes to the zero as n approaches infinity. It means this is a convergent series. similarly if you look about this series i can write this value as of again this is alternating series it means our target is to find this one on these properties so i can write this value as an 1 upon n so what is that this is here 1 by 3 raised to power n from 1 to infinity now what is that this is the gp series so i can substitute the value 1 by 3 a that is a, a 1 minus r raised to power n upon 1 minus r So one by three raised to power n over one minus r is by two by three. So what is the answer? Is one by two n of one minus one by three n. You can clearly see that this value goes to the zero as n approaches infinity. Also, this is the decreasing sequence. So it means this is also the convergent. How you can find the radius of convergence? Is radius of convergence is nothing but a n upon a n plus one. So you can substitute the values. A n is my one by three n. A n plus one is one upon three n plus one. So what is the answer? Is three, which is not equal to one by three. So it means this option is wrong. Now you can see this is not the alternating series, and this is the product of the two series are there. When you can say that this is the convergent, that is very simple. One of the sequence will be my bounded, other one is my monotonically decreasing, and convergent to the zero, converges to the zero. as n approaches infinity then this series is said to be the convergent by dirichlet test so you can check that which one is the u and v you can see that this series sign is always with bounded i can consider this as a v an i can consider as a v of n so this series is my bounded satisfied a of n we already proved that this is goes to the zero and this is a monotonically decreasing so the by the dirichlet test this is also the convergent so the right answer of this problem is my a b and d are there so this is the way you can solve such kind of the problems in a very simple manner we will see question number 32 and the others are there in our next videos till then you can simply share this video with your friends subscribe the channel best of luck students happy learning